All right, guys, so it's me again, and as you can see, I've been drawing a lot to draw this Phineas Flynn from Phineas and Ferb. Now, if you want to be a god at drawing Phineas and Ferb, well, just Phineas, like I am, what you want to do is grab your paper right there. That's your paper, what you're working with. And then you gotta get the second most important thing, your pencil. Like you need to draw with a pencil, and make sure you have an eraser. So if you mess up, I have this pencil here, which doesn't have an eraser, but I do have a, another pencil that does have an eraser. So without further ado, let's get started. So when you're drawing Phineas, you always want to start off with his eyeballs. That's what I do. A circle, as you could see. Now, you're gonna turn it like this. Draw a big line. So it should look like the body of a stick figure, kind of. Then you're gonna turn it and draw a little feet away. Draw another half a circle. So it looks like that. Then we're gonna draw the pupils. It's very simple. Oval, oval, circle, circle. Then you just color it in. Now I don't think I can draw an exact picture that looked like, you know, you know, Mr. Beast over here, this thing, that was the best one I've ever drawn. Okay, moving on. Now, we're going to tilt it. I'll draw it with his mouth closed and his mouth open. And we'll also draw the body, too. So, now, you're just going down, down, until you go a little bit further past the eye. Okay, well... Well, I'm just gonna fix mine. Just kidding. Oh. But I will need to erase mine a little because I went a little too far than normal. Because this is, you're not supposed to go too far. So let me fix that one. There we go. Now we're gonna draw his mouth open. You wanna draw a line kind of close to the eye, turn it around. Draw a little more, and then just draw the rest. Now, as teeth are simple, draw a little further, then you do a little, boom, that's his mouth. Now, we're going to color it black. So, this finish will turn out really good if you are a good artist like I am. All right, it should look like that. Well, not like that. I kind of did it a little wrong here. Let me fix this. So we do this, and then we just do this. Okay. Oh, my God, that's so bad. This might take a while to fix because you want to make sure you get it at the right precise angle. Okay, so at this rate, I'd be like... There. Okay. All right. Now it should look like this. I'm gonna make sure you can see this. It should look like that. Kind of Phineas's head, but not full Phineas. Now you're gonna act like you're drawing above it, and then draw a mark here. A plus. Well, not a plus. And then you... Stop here. Now, I know he has ears, but we'll move on to that because this makes it kind of easier if you don't draw without the ears. So we're going to do... Do... All right, now we're going to point it so it would look like that, kind of. So if I drew a line there, it'd match. Then we're going to draw a line here. Then we're going to draw a really 
big spike, a little spike, and then act like if I drew this line. Now we're gonna draw a freckle, freckle, freckle. There, that's Phineas, that's how it's so far. Now make sure it's, so if I drew a line here with the eraser, match up and stop until you get, like until you erase a lot of his head. So now you have this big gap. Draw a little line here, half a circle, that, and then you're gonna draw a three. Depending on which face, where he's facing, the three will be backwards. If he was pointing that way, the three would be backwards. So, yeah. If he is facing this way, his three would look like this. Right, no, that's that. That kind of, that thing, so, yeah. All right, now I'm gonna just erase some of it so we can actually fit in his collar. I'm gonna draw a that. Now it looks like that. Very simple so far, as you can see. Now we have our Phineas head. We're gonna go on to the body. Now, the way I do this, I think I remember looking at some pictures of him and I was seeing this. Instead of just drawing it like this, you want to draw it like this. Yeah, that's how you want to draw it. So we're going to take this. We're going to start from here. Do a line down and come all the way back up and matching it like that. That's how you're supposed to draw it. Then we're going to start from here. And then draw all the way down. Come back up. And boom, we're gonna draw the other sleeve. Do that, boom, it should look like that. Let me fix that some more. There, that's your Phineas so far. That's not the end of Phineas just yet. We still have to do his pants. So, we're gonna just Now, I imagine you just saying, hey, how come you aren't drawn like this? Like doing the classic this. Uh-uh, that's not what you do. You draw just like a square. And then you draw the line up like that. Draw a little bit of that with two lines inside of it. That's his pocket, right? So you just do... This, that, that. Now that's what your Phineas is gonna look like. Okay, I should stop saying that, but okay. And we're gonna draw this hand, cause I feel like that's easier. We stop until we get to here. Then we draw finger, finger, finger. You should only draw three, it, cause of this. Cause when you have your hands kinda like this, you can't see all your fingers, cause you know, your shirt and feet and stuff block it, kinda. And you're holding, it doesn't matter. But on this one, we're gonna draw a stop. Finger, 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 finger. Okay, now it's like that. Let me just fix this hand so you guys could see it better. There. Okay, I'm gonna fix the mouth a little cause I don't think I colored it in real too well. So, you wanna make sure you get that dark in there, like this black, kinda. Make sure you don't color outside of the thing that you're supposed to color. If you do, just erase it. There, now that looks way better. Okay, fix it. You wanna make sure it looks good and it looks actually like what you're trying to draw. We're not gonna draw the feet just yet. That's what we do last. Oh, shoot. I kinda made it so instead of going straight, it just curved into its arm. That's not good. Now we're gonna draw 
boop, boop. And we're not just gonna draw a straight line there. That's not what you're supposed to do. Now you go from this, and then you do this. Then you do that, that. So it could kind of look like, it would look like this. That's what it would kind of look like. <coughs> oh, third. A little dry, but. All right, now we're gonna draw his other thing on his shirt. Boop. And then we kind of stop over here. All right, tell it what it looks like. Now, I'm gonna draw his feet. We wanna draw another line in here. And then that, so it should look like three little lines. Now we're gonna draw his shoes. He's got some shoes, some different shoes, but these are the shoes I normally see him in. Do that, 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 and then do little squares and boom. That's Phineas, that's how it looks. Um, yeah, like I said before, this took forever to actually draw. I It took me several drawings. The first drawing of Phineas I did, it was not too good. So I'll be back with it. You might like it, you might not. Right. Now, don't focus on like, these things. Focus on the one that's right in front of you in color. Boom, that was the first ever drawing of Phineas I did. Wow. That was not the bestest drawing of him I did. Look at that. That head. It looks like this instead of doing... Uh, Let's try to copy it kind of like from the intro. You know, how he's doing it. How he does this thing how he does I was trying to copy him from doing that but looks like that didn't you know look the best as I expected it to but anyways this is the goddess drawing of Phineas I ever done this is one of the worst but eh. it's whatever now I remember I told you I draw him with his mouth closed that's exactly what we're gonna do because I said I would. Okay, whatever. Yeet. All right, you know the usual step. So I'm gonna try actually, you know, doing good on this one. Give him some big circle eye. Then flip it over. Okay, I drew it a little lower. <laughs> Alright, now we have this part. Let me just draw his pupils. You might hear me do this intense breathing action. I'm sorry, first of all. And I have the little line there. Boom. That's basically that. Then we do our usual head. how my drawings look of Phineas when I do like the, the try to draw the ear without doing my normal just drawing a line across then erase it then draw your ear on it because that's that's really that's hard kind of alright 
Alright, now we're gonna do... Alright, basically that's it, kinda. How you draw them with its mouth closed. That only took like three minutes. Not gonna lie. I mean, it, I don't draw Ferb too well, but maybe you'll like this one. It's not too good of a Ferb drawing. I gotta go get it. So, BRB. Now, this might not be the Ferb you were expecting. It's not Young Ferb. It is the adult version of Ferb. It's not too bad, really. And we have his hair along the side, the, you know, face. He's got his kind of triangle, you know, mouth. I did pretty good with the pants, the shirt, arms. Not my best drawing of fur, but I, I, I like it. I like it, to be honest. It's not, I haven't drawn fur too much. I spent basically my entire weekend just drawing Phineas for whatever reasons. Just to get good at it, you know. Get good. Good. <clears throat> but anyways. Yeah, so before I post this video, I want you guys to stay tuned about something new coming. Alright, get ready. Full... Guess what? Phineas and Ferb are coming now to this channel soon. I'm sorry that Phineas looks bad. I didn't really put my best effort into it. But Phineas and Ferb is coming to Tiny Mo TV. And you and hopefully you are free to watch me on this day, August 15th. I already have one plushie today. I got it for a while. And I'm waiting for the other two to come. Phineas and Ferb. But we do have our Agent P. Yes. Check it out. Wall. Oh yeah, Perry the Platypus. It's so good and fun. No, oh, oh, let me fix that backside. And then finally this side. This for this, I am not selling this because I am using this for my videos. But you know, Agent P, how do I? And you might be asking some questions, so I am gonna answer those right now. This was a how to draw video, and I'm gonna also give you a surprise and some questions. When will my Phineas and Ferb plush come? The Phineas is said to be coming on August 10th, five days before it. And the Ferb is supposed to come around August 12th to August 13th. So either one of those days, I'm gonna be getting it. The Phineas is in Pennsylvania and it, the Ferb is in Florida. That's where they bought there from. So yeah, let's just get hyped. And luckily it's not on the 15th, the day we leave, and that I'm gonna be getting my plushies. Because if we do, that'd be really upset. What will the first video be about on this, on the first video? Well, you probably guessed it. It's, it's the beach. Yep, I'm going to the beach and staying at a beach house. Yep, not the best, but hey, at least we'll be boogie boarding all day. And as soon as I get there, I'm going to start filming videos. So, yeah. I should sit, Perry. Would you ever get a Candace or a Dr. Heinz Doofenshmirtz? No, actually. I have to figure out what I'm gonna buy. I bought the Phineas and Ferb off to eBay, and I've already had this Perry the Platypus plush for a while now. But you know, I for the I'm just gonna have to figure out a plot, which I already did, in case I have to figure out what to do with like Candace or something. Yeah, so keep out. One day I'm gonna get the Dr. Heinz Doofenshmirtz and, you know, Candace. Fun fact.
Doofenshmirtz was gonna, his name was originally gonna be Metal Smirtz. So, yeah, just keep that in mind. I want fun fact. So, I'm just thinking of one question you might be asking me. I know a lot of you are gonna ask when that thing would come. So, the fur would come around to, like three or two days before we'd leave. So, yeah. Um, where are you guys going at a beach house? Well, North Carolina. Hashtag North Carolina for baby boys. Okay. So, yeah, it's fun, really. Um, I don't know where in North Carolina we are going, but we are going to North Carolina, and that's what I know. What a good state to be in. Um... If you need any other questions, then I don't know really. So, yeah, I guess you could just go on Facebook, I guess, and ask questions. I'm just kidding. I don't really know, but you might. You could ask me on Facebook. I don't know really, but yeah. So that's going to conclude this video of drawing Phineas from Phineas and Ferb and um, some uh, helpful uh, fun fact about this channel now. Oh, by the way, if you want to do this Perry the Platypus sound, this is what you have to do. So you want to stick your tongue so it's t kind of touching all the way back like this. Then you want to close your mouth. Kind of close it fully with that happening. Open this part of your cheek kind of up like this. And then just... Exhale kind of a little hard. <laughs> oh, dang, it's bad because I just figured this out. <laughs> It's really hard. You, you need to be good at doing this. Like, you have to practice doing it, but it's hard. You can just Google it, I guess. Or you can just watch videos if that's really not helping. But anyways, see you later, guys. Stay tuned for the fun Phineas and Ferb coming soon.